Good morning, trucking junkies. Oh man, I am sorry about last night's video. That was my fault. So I get parked, talk to my wife, then I talk to you guys, and then I start uploading video. Well, I get everything edited and I get it started uploading. I really wasn't feeling good last night. I didn't have dinner or anything. I just wasn't feeling right. Very tired. So, I got my thumbnail done. I got it uploaded. And I was waiting for the, <clears throat> for the video to upload. And I laid down and I was thinking, well, if I fall asleep, at least it's, it's uploading. I've got my, I've got my laptop hooked up to the to the outlet so it's not going to die and it's still open so it's not going to shut off and if I fall asleep then it'll get uploaded it'll be it'll be out there right I get up this morning because I fell asleep like I probably knew I would and that sucker wasn't done it was sitting at 70% and that's my fault because when you're uploading straight to YouTube, there is a box you have to click to tell it whether or not you are making a video for kids or not. And I forgot to click that box and it wouldn't go any further than 70% until I clicked that box. Yeah. So video didn't get uploaded until this morning but it's out there go watch it I talk about tarpon <clears throat> well, we're uh, we're 128 miles from our drop-off over here in Dallas we're gonna be there around 11 11 20 somewhere in there if I don't get stopped for for traffic uh, so yeah, so stay tuned today. We're going to go find out what else we got to pick up. I got to take a picture for Special Olympics at some point today. I'm going to put my Special Olympics t-shirt on and put the banner on my truck. And uh, go do that. But we still got a random fact today. And I know I didn't do a dang people in that video last night. I was tired. That just means I got to do more. Hopefully today I'll get stopped sooner and I uh, won't feel so bad. I feel much better today than I did last night. I just wasn't feeling well last night. I got plenty of sleep though. Let's get this delivered. Let's go. We're here. Took a minute though. They had the wrong address in our system. They had it as... West Bowling instead of Bowden instead of regular Bowden. What's up, man? Hey, what's up? Hey, what's up? Hey, what's up? Sorry, we got to go around the building. Wow. Gotta go around everybody's cars over here, okay? That's awesome. Hope this guy in this red truck. Lord. Two trucks wouldn't be able to fit through there, that's for sure. We gotta go around here and go to go to door 49 it's the first time I've been here hope there's nothing coming on the way back hmm close that window it's loud well, they just cut their parking lot basically in half 
with this gate fence Lord nah. man they got businesses on top of businesses over here let's see there's door 46 42 And talked about packed in here. Look, there's some car bumpers. Or truck bumpers. It's easy. Uh, you guys have nothing to worry about. I'm a professional. Professional what? It's 549. Unloading. Oh, come down to this Walmart parking lot and sit for just a minute. We're, uh, what is this guy doing? Strange. Uh, we're going over to Midlothian to Gerdau and, uh, walking driving around in circles pick up some steel and that's going to Illinois doesn't have to be there until uh, Thursday so yeah let's go we are here we've been here for a minute I went ahead and took my 30 minute break I needed something to eat I'm hungry oh what that dome is over there weird <clears throat> everybody back here in line sleeping waiting on their appointment I guess but mine's in 10 minutes so we're gonna go up here and scale in yes we are let's go I am sitting still. We've been here for about 45 minutes, a little over. Still got one truck in front of me. It's a bummer. Random fact of the day. It's the random fact of the day. So this week I should be on a cruise ship. I should be on the Carnival Dream. And I should be, like, what is today, Tuesday? I should be on the ocean at this moment. Yesterday, we would have stopped in uh, uh, Puerto Rico, I believe. But, in order of supposed to be on a cruise ship, let's do some random facts from the cruise world. So, the largest cruise ship is from Royal Caribbean and that's the Symphony of the Seas and that's an Oasis class ship it's uh, it's got uh, two other um, two other cruise ships in that class there's a third one on the way uh, one of them is the Oasis of the Sea um, that was the first one I'm not sure what the third one is you got the Oasis of the Sea you've got the second one and then you've got the Symphony of the Sea uh, and that was the last one built and they've got another one on the um, on the way and that would be um, Mardi Gras and that and that one was due out this year but they've postponed it to next year they've they've stopped production on it um, the Symphony of the Sea will, can carry um, can carry 6600 up to 6600 passengers and it cost $1.35 billion to build. That is a huge ship. It's got a 10-foot water slide on the back. It's got like 20 pools. And it's just huge. And fact number two, uh, a normal cruise ship in a week will, will use 7,000 pounds of cheese. 
14,000 pounds of potatoes and over 21,000 ice cream cones in a week. Now, I know, I don't know if y'all have ever been on a cruise, but that ice cream machine is like, it's out there in the open for everybody to use, and it is just surrounded by kids constantly on carnival ships. It is ridiculous. It's like, I'm, I'm surprised they don't have kids just, you know, right in the mouth, you know, even waiting for it to get in a cone. Just constant kids around that thing. Music! And that's the random fact of the day. We are waiting at the scales. Yep. It's an easy load though. 20 feet of, of steel rod. I call it rod because it's smaller than bar. And I got two layers of that, six bundles. That's one tart. Sweet. Very happy about that. It is Driver Appreciation Week, people. I appreciate everybody that's out there driving. Uh, FedEx drivers, Prime drivers, Swift drivers, Maverick drivers. Big rig drivers, U-Haul drivers, Amazon drivers bringing me my stuff. Make sure you download, uh, uh, if you haven't downloaded your uh, Love's Pilot Flying J apps, they always have uh, specials throughout the month for Driver Appreciation Week. Uh, Pilot, I know, does like a drink a day for a whole month. You can get a free drink. It changes every day. Some days it's... Dr. Pepper, some days it's Mountain Dew, some days it's a coffee. But uh, if you've not downloaded those apps, go download them. If you're new to trucking, it's Driver Appreciation Week. Get some appreciation. I load. I got some more chains to throw. We're on our way. Actually, we got to go tarp too, so we got to move someplace else to tarp. So we are back on the road again. I uh, kind of took my time with it and wasn't in real big of a rush. Oh, and they gave me something. Let me show you. I'll show you here when I get stopped. I have parking reserved at, at the Flying J over in Anna, Texas. I need a shower. And there was going to be no parking when I got there in an hour or so. And, so I reserve parking, use my, my use my pilot points, and cost me zero dollars. All right. But uh, we've got all day tomorrow to drive this. Uh, we're gonna be we'll be there tomorrow night. Um, we're gonna drive. Act. We might have about 50 miles to drive uh, Thursday morning. We'll be pretty dang close. Pretty close tomorrow night. But I'm going to get off here and drive through Dallas through rush hour. Hopefully it won't take me very long. When we get parked, I'll show you what I got. Oh, we are straight down in Dallas. Hmm. It's a nice skyline, huh? Sweet. Yeah, I should have had my GoPro hooked up, but I had no time for that. Still got to get a picture for Special Olympics. Uh, if it's still light outside, I'll take that. Uh, after I get a shower. I don't know if it's going to be light or not. I may wait until in the morning. Get the picture and send it send it in. El Phoenix. Restaurant spelt with an F. Maybe that's how it's spelled in Spanish. I don't know. Does anybody know 
is Phoenix spelled F E N I X in Spanish. I'm going to guess so. Uh, we'll get through all these tunnels and stuff and get on the other side of this and head north a little bit. See, this right here is where you have a Ferrari or a Lambo or a loud Mustang. Point three miles ahead, you the left two lanes to stay on the first exit. Whatever that is. I'm not sure what those flags were, but okay. Let your freak flag fly, man. <laughs> Let's get out of Dallas. Well, I'm done for the night. And it was a difficult one too, boy. Uh getting in here to I got into this pilot. I reserved a spot online. Uh, about an hour ago well a little more than an hour ago now I've been here almost 30 minutes and uh, there were no spots when I got here no reserve spots and uh, so I went inside I told them that I reserved a spot showed them my my uh, confirmation online and uh, they had to come out here and make somebody move sorry hey, you pay for your spot if you want the reserve spot pay for that spot other than that, take your chances. Oh, I was going to show you. So, look at my hair. God, oh, look at that hair. Uh, so, at Gerdau, they gave us uh, Pringles. They gave us a, a drink, a Coke. And they gave me a new hat. I got a new hat. It needs, it's got a... A lot of people like the snapbacks. I don't. I like the Velcro bags. I can get it exactly that I can get it to fit right. Hey, a new hat. Check it out. That's how you do appreciation week. I'll tell you. But uh, tomorrow's an all drive day. I'm going to get this edited uh, before I go take a shower because this place is a cluster, man. It's horrible. It took me 20 minutes to get in here and people honking on the horn. Like I said, you just let Super Trucker Dan honk on that horn because you take your time. Uh, the gentleman next to me actually had to angle it in because I was doing a blind side back. And uh, he helped me out by angling, angling his truck a little bit. And that gave me a little bit more room. And we're in here without hitting anything. Gotta love that. There's another Maverick truck pulling in. But anyway, that's going to be it for today. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Peace out.